What is going on ladies and gentlemen? Today I have the exclusive opportunity to try the brand new strawberry passion fruit G Fuel flavor that is inspired by the new Armored Core game that is out today. Now when you're watching this video, the flavor should also be available to buy on the G Fuel website, so I will link that down below in the description. But I just want to say thank you G Fuel for taking the time to send out this sample early to me because this is what I'm talking about. I really want to be able to try these flavors before or at least the day that they're available so you guys can get a better grasp on if it's something you want to pre-order or not. So today I'm going to be trying and ranking the strawberry passion fruit flavor and I will try to make this video quick because I definitely want to get this up very soon. I'm also going to be streaming Armored Core tonight on Friday at about 8 p.m. Eastern time so if you guys want to join up on that make sure you have notifications on on my YouTube channel. And I'll also be giving away a ton of G Fuel as well during that stream. But anyways, ladies and gentlemen, let's go ahead and open up this strawberry passion fruit. So I have not had a passion fruit G Fuel flavor since I think Typo. I think Typo was the only passion fruit flavor we've like ever had from G Fuel. And that's been vaulted and gone for a very long time. So I'm very excited to try this. Let's open it up and give it a go. Here we go. Let's give it a smell here, shall we? Got the strawberry and a little bit of that passion fruit. Passion fruit is a very interesting fruit. It's got kind of like a funky tart taste to it. Like I would say it's kind of guava-ish. Not like fully like guava, but it's got kind of a little bit of that funk to it that guava has. Yeah, I'm mostly getting strawberry in the smell for sure. So I've got my shaker with 16 ounces of water and a few ice cubes. Let's go ahead and... All right, guys, I am going to go ahead and put in one scoop into the shaker. Now, I think they only sent me one scoop, but we're about to find out. Yeah, it looks like they only sent me one scoop, guys, which is fine. Looks like the color is red and blue, so I'm guessing like a purple. Also, while we're mixing this up, just wanted to say thank you everybody for using code SHOCK. There was a ton of you guys that picked up the Witcher flavor. Honestly, a lot more than I thought, but I gotta say the box and just everything looks amazing, so I do understand why so many of you guys ordered that one. So thank you everybody for using code SHOCK on that. And then the shiny splash cans also dropped yesterday as well. So thank you guys for picking those up with Code Chalk too. And if you guys have not been tweeting me with your Code Chalk orders, make sure to do that because I always like to retweet and like and make sure I'm following you guys if you tweet me with those orders. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's go ahead and give the Armored Core Strawberry Passion Fruit a smell. Here we go. All right. Definitely less strawberry in the or in the shaker when it's mixed up versus the powder. The powder was more strawberry. I think this is definitely more passion fruit, but it's not like overwhelming or anything. It just kind of smells less, just smells way less strong in the, when it's mixed up in the water. But anyways, guys, let's try it. Here we go. The Armored Core flavor. Whoa, okay. I definitely think there's more passion fruit than strawberry. And I'm happy about that because I really miss passion fruit. And we have so many strawberry flavors that I'm happy that it's more on the passion fruit side. A lot of articles on Google say that they think passion fruit can kind of taste somewhat between like a grapefruit, pear, guava, sometimes a yellow kiwi or pineapple. For me, I think the passion fruit that I'm tasting that is in here definitely guava for sure. I think passion fruit is very similar to guava. Also, this is not extremely tart at all. I mean, it's got some normal levels of tartness, but I've had a real passion fruit 
a few times and they are very, very tart. This is not very tart. Also, some people say that passion fruit has a pomegranate hint to it. I could maybe see that. I would say you're getting, yeah, passion fruit for me in here is maybe like a pomegranate guava taste. That's probably what I'd say. And the strawberry is not very strong. It's there, but it's not like crazy strong. I would say you're probably getting a 60 to 65% passion fruit and the passion fruit in here is not very tart. And then you're getting a 40 to 35% of a strawberry. So my typo is pretty far expired, but this is well, the only other flavor that G Fuel has done that has passion fruit. And this is the only thing that I can relate it to. Um, but I will say, I feel like this passion fruit here is a lot different than the passion fruit in Armored Core. Um, I don't know what it is, but I feel like it's just, it was much, much stronger um, in typo. Like, I feel like it could be that, you know, the strawberry is just balancing it out a lot, but I definitely feel like um, the typo passion fruit is definitely somewhat of a different type of passion fruit taste. So if you're looking for Armored Core to be the same as typo, I don't think it is the same. That also could be that typo was the 25 calorie version and uh, this one is a 15 calorie version. So it's a completely new formula. Now in terms of a ranking, I am going to put this in my tier list when I get the official tub in November. But for right now, in terms of just a baseline number, I'd probably give it somewhere between seven and like an eight right now. And I think after a while of drinking it and having the official tub, I will be able to narrow down that final rating. But anyways, guys, I wanna thank you for watching my early exclusive review. Thanks to G Fuel and our Armored Core for uh, allowing me to review it early. I really, really do appreciate it. And if you guys do want to pick up this flavor with Code Shock, it is available right now to pre-order. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for being here and peace out.